Hi, this is Ajay Jangir in this video and you are watching Jogi and You. Friends, today I'm gonna tell you a excellent trick from the very famous Vedic math. The Rishi Munis from the ancient India developed a great and outstanding mathematics and I thought the maths we are studying today is all created by them. So what we are going to learn today is the fast way to find the cube of double digit number. And for finding the cube of any double digit number, we have to multiply two numbers with each other and then multiply the result with third number. I mean if we want to calculate the cube of 3 then we multiply 3 with 3 and we will multiply the result with 3 again. This is the basic method of cube but here we will calculate the whole result in a single way. So for example I have a question which is 12 cube. Just see how I am solving this and later I will tell you the method and trick. By the way exams are coming and this time an academy is back with Revisathon 2.0 and it is even bigger than before. Revisathon 2.0 is a 5 day event for learners of class 9 to 12 to revisit all the important topics so get set for your final and board exams. Our top educators are already preparing themselves to help you revisit all important concepts in 5 power pack season for each subject from 16th of January to 20th of January. So get ready to attend this absolutely free event which is open for all. All you need to do is just visit our landing page to enroll in all the seasons. All the links are given below in the description. Just go and win the world. Now let's come back to our current question. So here we write the first number 1 and then it's 6 and then 12 and in the last it's 8. So just add them all which is 8. 2, 6 plus 1, 7 and 1. So the perfect cube of 12 is 1, 7, 2, 8. So did you see how we solve it with the help of very few digits while finding the cube of any number is very lengthy process. So first of all I will tell you the method of this so you can also solve it easily and then I will give two example and both are different. That doesn't mean if you understand one example so you can solve the second example also. First example is for two step and the second is of three steps. So you have to learn both otherwise you will miss something. And in the last I will give you a question to check your brilliancy. So just solve that question with this method and write your answer in the comment box. But yes don't use the calculator if you are brilliant. So let's get back to the method. And for the method, there is a cubic formula which is a plus b the whole cube. I hope you all know this cubic formula which is a cube plus 3a square b plus 3ab square plus b cube. This cubic formula is very important formula for the algebra and the Rishi Munis of the India also have used this formula to find the cube of double digit number. So that's why this method is called Vedic method for the calculation in mathematics. So for using this formula in our method, just replace all these positive signs from the formula. So the position of the formula we have will exactly right for our work. So just wipe it and take our question which is cube of 23. And for that we will use the method. And what was the first part of the formula in this method? AB cube. So look clearly in the question 2, 3 is a cube and here AB is cube. So if we compare both a is equals to 2 and b is equals to 3. So what is the first term of the expansion of formula? a cube so replace a with 2. So 2 cube is 8. So we will write 8 here on the first place. And after that what is our second step? 3 a square b. If we replace number with a and b then we will got 3 2 square 3. And after calculating we will place it here which is 36. So there is a question here why we wrote 36 in cross here or diagonally here and the answer is according to our method we only can write a single number here and we have any double digit number to write like 36 then the unit will be placed here and the tens will be on the left side but if you see there is a number there already so we cannot overwrite this. So just slide down the tens digit here. And if the number was triple digit then our third digit will be in the even more left. 
सो वॉट इज द थर्ड पार्ट ऑफ आर फॉर्मूला थ्री ए बी स्क्वायर एंड आफ्टर रिप्लेसिंग ए एंड बी विद टू एंड थ्री वी गेट थ्री टू थ्री स्क्वायर एंड आफ्टर कैलकुलेटिंग दिस वी गॉट फिफ्टी फोर विच इज रिटर्न हियर लाइक दिस एंड वॉट इज द लास्ट स्टेज ऑफ द फॉर्मूला बी क्यूब एंड बी क्यूब मीन्स थ्री क्यूब सो थ्री क्यूब इज ट्वेंटी सेवन सो वी राइट ट्वेंटी सेवन इन डायोगनली हियर सो ऑल वी हैव टू डू नाउ इज जस्ट सम ऑल द नंबर्स रिटर्न हियर जस्ट लाइक सेवन फोर प्लस टू सिक्स सो सिक्स प्लस फाइव इज इक्वल्स टू इलेवन सो वन विल बी हियर एंड वन विल बी एज कैरी सो थ्री प्लस एट प्लस वन इज इक्वल्स टू ट्वेल्व सो ट्वेल्व थाउजेंड वन सिक्सटी सेवन इज द परफेक्ट क्यूब ऑफ ट्वेंटी थ्री सो यू अंडरस्टैंड हाउ टू कैलकुलेट द रूट ऑफ ट्वेंटी थ्री यू सी द मेथड आई एम टेकिंग अ वन मोर नंबर विच इज लिटल बिट डिफरेंट सो वॉच इट केयरफुली प्रैक्टिस दिस टू एंड थ्री टाइम्स एंड देन यू कैन ईजिली सॉल्व इट एंड इफ यू कीप प्रैक्टिसिंग दिस यू कैन डू इट वेरी फास्टली देन द रूटीन वे सो आर नेक्स्ट एंड लास्ट क्वेश्चन इज सेवनटीन क्यूब सो द फर्स्ट टर्म ऑफ द फॉर्मूला इज ए क्यूब विच इज वन क्यूब so just write this one on the left side here and what is the second form of this formula 3a square b means 3 1 1 2 7 calculate it and after calculating we got 21 so just write 21 here and what is the third term of the formula the third term of the formula is 3ab square which means 3 1 7 square and after calculating this we got 147 so look here carefully before now we only got two digits here just like 21 41 any but now we got three digit here 147 what we will do is 7 is unit so it will be here and after that we have to write 4 in the left here but place is already occupied so we wrote it here below and one has to be placed here on the left of 4 but if you see that place is also occupied by 2 so we write 1 even below than 2 so if it was four digit number it might be goes more left and below so what is the last position of the formula b cube which is 7 cube so the cube of 7 is 343 so we place it here in the last in same method as we did before we wrote in diagonally and now just sum all these numbers 3 Is three, seven plus four is equals to eleven. One is here and one carry. One one four three is nine, and one plus two plus one is equals to four. So four nine one three is the perfect cube of seventeen. But if you see, we have only some numbers here. But if you do seventeen multiply by seventeen multiply by seventeen, then your process will be lengthy. So all I want to say is, if you want to do the fast calculation, then you have to keep practicing for that, and might be you can solve it verbally after practicing. And now I have a question for you, which is, find the cube of twenty-five and twenty-seven, and find this cube with the same method without using calculator. Calculate, practice, and write your answer in the comment box, and do let me know how brilliant you are. So friends. If you like my videos hit the like button subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon for such more videos so that's it for today thanks for watching